Hi, my name is Cameron Carlson with AnimeLocation.tv. I'm here at OhioCon 2020 with my pal, Mr. Robert Mungle. How are you doing? I'm doing well. Good to be here again. Yeah, you got a. Last time it was a little clean shaven. Now we've got this wonderful beard going on. Right. I just kind of uh, decided to not care anymore. So <laughs> just let it go. Alrighty. So last time we got the chance to talk to you was at OhioCon 2017. How have you been since then? Uh, good. This is the first time back since then. I'm um, looking forward to. Uh, Coming back next year, we had a good time this week, and uh, I, I, this is one of my favorite cons of the year. All the time. Well, since uh, last time we got the chance to talk to you, you got roasted at uh, OhioCon 2017. How was it like to be up there and have everybody just go, hey, buddy, love you, but we're going to dish on you, especially because you decided to bring all your wonderful comedic friends with you, and also Kiki. Yeah. Well, they asked me who I wanted to have roast me, and I said, well, I know a lot of comedians, and I trust them more than I do all these other actors. <laughs> So I went and brought in professionals to really get into it. So that's always a lot of fun, and they're all very talented, and we always have a lot of fun with that. And then on top of that, since the last time we got the chance to talk to you, working on Food Wars, uh, which is a weird mix of yeah. food and eating brings out um, just orgasms. So what was it like working on that show? That's uh, Yeah, it's, it's anime. What are you going to do? I mean, it's uh, food and sex and uh, all this other stuff wrapped into one, and it's a lot of fun. Yeah, I enjoyed it. <laughs> I get to play multiple characters on there, so okay. that's always fun, yeah. Yeah, and I think, uh, was it season four has just finished, or is it season three? Yeah, three or five, I don't remember. It's all, it's all a blur. <laughs> it's a blur. It'll be, out, it'll be on sometime. You'll see it. Yeah. Um, so um, a show that has been really fun uh, for the fans to watch, I really appreciate it, was uh, uh, Gummy Got Kill. Yeah. Your character is pretty much nuts and really pushes the team to the limit. How much fun was it to play him? I mean, he's, he's this guy with a big eye in the middle, and he really, like, he's just, his whole thing's just straight up murder. What was it like trying to bring out, like, that intention of, like, everyone around me must die? Yeah, that's a lot of typecasting there. Yeah. I have no idea what that's like. Yeah. Yeah, I just... Uh, that's fun. I get to play those kind of guys. That's always the best fun. And I had my best death scene ever. Yeah. And I got, to, I got to die very well. And I thought I should have been up for a while. I got nothing for that. No award. Nobody said, hey, you know, maybe this is your best. No, nothing. But I really died well. So. Yeah, I really enjoyed it because it kind of was like a Game of Thrones anime style. Because yeah. like, I was like, you can't kill this character. Oh, they did. Oh, yeah. there goes the main character at the very end of the whole show. I'm like, what? Yeah, they just busted it. I was like, okay, that was my finest work. Now I'm done. <laughs> Great. Back to doing generals. <laughs> Terrific. Now, you continue to do stand-up with a bunch of your friends. How's that side of your career going? Uh, that's dead now. <laughs> yeah, I, quit. I actually retired from stand-up. Oh, really? uh, middle of last year, I had a, a big throw blowout show for my final time, and I've done it once or twice since then, but I don't. Uh, it's not a pursuit I do anymore. I'm doing some other projects now. I take up my time, and uh, I got tired of going to crappy little towns for no money. Yeah. So I'm doing other stuff now. Alrighty, yeah. so, uh, and again, you're still doing your podcast called The Whiskey yeah. Brothers. How's that going for you guys? And um, have you guys gone to more anime cons to perform uh, The Whiskey Brothers? Uh, we have done, we did one in Houston. Uh, it's tough to get all our schedules together at the same time, but we are going to uh, Chicago later this year, and I think we're going to bring the whole crew back here to OhioCon next year. Oh. That's what I'm hoping. That's yeah. what I, we've been talking, so we'll see if we can get them all, all the schedules in line. But yeah, that's the hope. Some more misadventures? More misadventures, yeah. It's hard to get our schedules, everybody lined up. So we, if we can do two or three a year, we're, we're, yeah, we're lucky. Yeah. <laughs> All righty. Now, um, are there any upcoming titles you want fans to know about at this time that they might be able to check out that aren't behind, you know, the NDA wall? Uh, no. <laughs> I just finished up my work on Food Wars, and I'm going to start another project, and I'm told in three weeks, but I don't know what that is. So Kind of the actor's life. Yeah. It's just they call me, I come in, and then talk into a box. That's it. <laughs> So. Alrighty. Now, where can we follow you online? I know you have a wonderful Twitter full of wonderful uh, updates on things. And then uh, what message would you love to give to the fans that have been keeping up with you through the Whiskey Brothers and then, you know, through your anime voice acting work? Uh, keep, uh, keep supporting it. Keep coming to the con. The cons are a lot of fun. If you can find one in your neighborhood or your neck of the woods, go to it. Support the art. Uh, buy, don't steal. You know, that, that keeps this whole thing in business. And uh, just keep supporting it. Yeah. And where can we find you on Twitter? Uh, you can find me at Reverend Rob, or uh, Reverend Mungle, yeah, on Twitter, yeah. All right, hey, it's been wonderful chatting with you. Thank you. Thank you so much for coming out and hanging out with me today. Thank you so much. Thank you, and have a good time. Yeah.